Welcome back everyone. I love cakes with apples so today I'm going to share with you an old Irish apple cake recipe. My granny used to make this apple cake in the open fire. My mum said she baked it in a cast iron pan covered with a lid and she used to place the hot coals from the fire on top to bake it. That's how everything was baked in Ireland 80 years ago and I bet it tasted wonderful. Okay, let's get started. Sieve together self-raising flour, ground cloves and salt into a large bowl. Next add in the room temperature butter, I cut mine into small cubes as it's easier to rub into the flour. When you have breadcrumb consistency, it's ready. Cut in the cooking apples, I'm using three large cooking apples. Slice thinly into the mixture, not too thick or it will take too long to bake. Mix the apples into the butter and flour mixture. Pour in the sugar and mix again until it's fully combined. You'll find the recipe for this Irish apple cake in the description box under the video. We're going to add eggs and milk to this. Mix together before adding. This mixture won't be very wet, more like a fairly stiff dough. Give it all a good mix. It's ready, let's get it into the tin. Place in a 7 or 8 inch grease tin and use a spoon to smooth the top until it's level. Sprinkle some demerara or granulated sugar on top. Bake at 190 degrees Celsius, 375 degrees Fahrenheit for about 50 to 60 minutes. This apple cake smells so good and looks fantastic. I bet when my granny made this, it was really appreciated. This apple cake can be served cold or warm with cream and custard. I love it warm, straight from the oven, and like everything, this is best eaten fresh. I hope you try out this Irish apple cake recipe and enjoy it as much as I do. Don't forget to subscribe or follow my page. Happy baking everyone. Mmm,